I have the DeWalt 20 volt battery kit. It comes with two batteries, a charger and an adapter for your old 18 volt tools. So I was at Lowe's Hardware and I saw this tool off a shelf and then I've never seen this before. So I saw the adapter and it seems to make sense. Um, the adapter lets you use, lets you continue to, continue to use your 18 volt tools. That uh, I have a lot of 18 volt volt tools that use the old nickel cadmium batteries. And uh, in, in addition to that, I can use, I can not only use my own, my old uh, 18 volt batteries. I could, I could buy new 20 volt tools. There are a lot of people who uh, who won't give up their old 18 volt tools. That's I also have a collection of them, saws and drills and hacksaws that I can't just throw away or sell. It wouldn't, wouldn't make sense to sell because it's not worth it. You know, what should I do with it? Can't throw them all away. Can't throw away all my 18 volt tools just to buy a new set of 20 volt tools. And. Uh, in my opinion, the DeWalt seems a little slow in coming up with new stuff, but they do have a, but they do support their large users of 18 volt tools, so they don't abandon their user base in in order to get you to buy new stuff. So that's a, a good quality of them. I don't do uh, a lot of unboxings, but. Uh, this uh, just got in. I haven't tried it yet, so I have no idea how it will even work. So I'll go ahead and get some, uh, get an 18 volt tool and test this. You know, I already have a 18 volt battery that's uh, lithium ion, but I can't find those anymore. Uh, maybe they're trying to discontinue these batteries. You know, they get you to buy. New batteries could say maybe they're having a hard time trying to get people get rid of uh, their old tools. So let me open this up with uh, the box cutter because it has the the, bit, the uh, blister pack has has these uh, you know things glued to it. So we'll just flip it out. We'll just take out a knife and. I think I'll do that again. Okay, so got a charger, two batteries, and this guy. Well, let's take a look. All right, so it's got this thing here. Let's take it out. And let's see how it fits in there. So you can't just slide it in there like it used to be. Used to be the you know the 18 volt batteries just slide right in and clicks. This one doesn't seem to do that. Oh, I do. Oh, it does. Just got it. Oh. Oh. It's a little. The clip is a little rough, but it does go in and out. It's not that bad. Oh, you just gotta pinch it really hard. Okay. Let's, which way does it go? Comes a little battery gauge there. slide out not bad and I guess if you want to remove the battery in its entirely you probably have to take two of them out Take out the battery and then the adapter. Okay, it's not bad. 
It takes a little bit of getting used to, but not bad. Alright, uh, so that's it. So it works. I'm happy, I guess. The adapter that's been talked about, but right after I bought it, I went and I searched for prices. And I found in the reviews that people were complaining that the adapter drained power even when it's not being used. So when you have the battery like this, just like that, it will drain power. It'll take about a week and it will drain everything. Drain it to death in about a week. Just like that. So I'll, I'll test it and I'll see if that's true or not. I believe that the circuit is probably the problem. My, my guess, I'm not, I haven't tried, I haven't taken it apart yet, but my guess is that the circuit in the adapter to, I don't know if it's a protection circuit or whatever that drains from it. All right, so I did some research and I left the battery in the adapter for about a week. And what happens is it will slowly drain the power from the battery. Even if you don't use it, it will just slowly drain it. So if I just leave it like that, even if I take it out of the tool, so if I take it out of the tool, if I just have it just like this adapter and the battery, it will slowly the circuit. I guess either the protection circuit or, or whatever it does, that maybe it steps down voltage, I don't know, maybe not, I don't know. But uh, it just drains the battery a little. Alright, thanks for watching. And um, if you do buy this, uh, just remember to take out the battery. Uh, I think it's a, it's an issue, but um, it's better than throwing away all your tools. Alright, so that's something to think about. And I, I, w I would still kind of recommend it. Thanks for watching.